You're listening to The John and Heidi Show. Now, featuring the wit and wisdom of Dan Ferris. Okay, dudes, let's walk this sucker. On Sunny 93.3. It's The John and Heidi Show bonus hour without Dan Ferris today. Again, Again. hoping to have him back real, real soon. But while he's gone, I got some big shoes to fill, Heidi. Yes, and you I, do. I decided since I've got these big shoes to fill, I'm gonna gonna call in the big guns. I uh, I reached out to my friends at Sioux Falls Fun Page, and they have a thing called uh, This Day in Sioux Falls History, and I think this is really kind of a neat thing. So it was on this day, January the 25th, 1965. Nils A. Bow was elected governor of South Dakota. Now, here's the thing that's kind of cool. He's from the state of South Dakota. He's actually from Sioux Falls. Okay. In the 132-year state history from 1889 all the way up until now, only a few statewide elections were won by people from Sioux Falls. Okay. And just two governors have been from Sioux Falls, Joe Foss and Nils A. Bo. Now, Dick Knight, Bill Janklow, and Dennis Sugard were all from places very close by. Our second citizen, local citizen to win the governor's seat, Bo, championed cutting property taxes. I like that idea. Right. Improving workers' education. I like that. Okay. And preparing South Dakota for the 21st century. Visionary. That was in 1965, keep in mind. All right. Bo served as a state legislator and lieutenant governor before running the state. He also held many high-power federal positions after his governorship came to an end. He was the first director of intergovernmental affairs, a justice on the U.S. Customs Court, serving as the court's chief justice for six years, and lastly had a seat on the U.S. Court of International Trade. Very cool. In 1971, with the help of his two surviving sisters, Lois and Borg- Borgheil, I've never heard that name before. Uh, Nils would make an even greater impact on Sioux Falls history than he did as the governor of South Dakota when he developed an endowment at Augustana College for the Center for Western Studies. The endowment created the Bow Forum, which I've heard of before, and I didn't know that's what it was from. The Bow Forum on Public Affairs, an annual event inviting world-renowned speakers to the Augustana campus in Sioux Falls. Oh, so I yeah, hear that I've heard all of that the time. Too. Now we know why it's called that. That's right. Very cool. Nils Bo, through the endowment, has been responsible for bringing in high-ranking politicians to the town, including Madeleine Albright, Colin Powell, President George H.W. Bush, Newt Gingrich, Al Gore, Barbara Bush, Sandra Day O'Connor, and others. Uh, A whole lot of people that he's brought here. Uh, World leaders like Mikhail Gorbachev. Okay. Queen Noor, Desmond Tutu. Wow. Uh, and, and a whole bunch more. Uh, it says here, Sioux Falls will forever be indebted to Nils A. Bohr for his contributions to our community. So if you'd like to read that or if you're going, okay, I need to know a little more about that, Sioux Falls Fun page on Facebook, and I'll throw a link to it on our Facebook page, facebook.com slash Sunny Radio. Do you ever get credit card offers in the mail? Those are usually the worst offers. They spend thousands of dollars mailing them to anyone with an address. The people who actually read their junk mail end up paying the price in the long run. At BetterCreditCards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Whether you want a credit card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at BetterCreditCards.com. Give yourself a little credit. BetterCreditCards.com. Time now for Back to the Basics in Healthcare with Balanced Life Chiropractic. And we have Dr. Harley. How are you doing, Dr. Harley? Hey, John. I'm doing fantastic. Man, those trees over the weekend were so oh, yeah. pretty. I've heard some people like, oh, I don't like winter, but it's like, I, well, the, I, I'm glad we have winter. It's year. beautiful to look at from a distance, maybe on a screensaver from Tahiti. Mm-hmm. So. <laughs> so one of the things we're going to do right now is kind of start from the beginning because there are people who maybe have heard us talking over the last couple of years, but if they didn't listen a couple of years ago when we first started chatting, let's talk a little bit about Balanced life chiropractic and who you are and how long you've been doing this yeah it's uh great great to just kind of go back to the basics sometimes and just introduce us well i'm dr harley martinmoss i'm with balance life chiropractic we opened in september of 2020 so and all of you are like ooh, covid and all yeah that. weird time to open a business isn't it right but, i mean we only knew anything from like you know bottom to up right yeah. we can only go up and it really actually was a great time because with covid people really started to look at their health more, you know, yeah. starting to like, oh, crap, this has been scary. What is going on? You know, what can we do to help promote our health, make our health better so we don't have, you know, bad side effects or anything like that? So that was not necessarily taking advantage of that, but it's just like it was a great time to open a health practice because people are looking for something. 
And sometimes when people are looking for something, they find the wrong thing. So they want to make sure they find the right thing. And the nice thing about chiropractic, it's not a bunch of medicine. It's not, you know, getting shots. It's not getting mm-hmm. all kinds of foreign things stuffed in there. It's, it's all natural. Right. You know, we really help your body heal from the inside out without the use of drugs or medicine or surgery or anything like that. Your, your body is designed to heal. It's designed to heal itself, regulate itself. But sometimes, you know, things can get in the way, having causing issues, you know, basically look at like stress, you know, physical stress, emotional stress, all that can disrupt the normal processes inside your body. And that's what's leading to the aches, pains and dysfunction. So us as chiropractors, you know, we're looking at basically where the stress is at in your nervous system, where those misalignments are happening that's blocking your nervous system from functioning like it's supposed to. So then by adjusting those areas that are stuck, we're going to restore the proper communication in your body that's going to lead to better health and healing in the long run so that's really what chiropractic is in a nutshell is mm, helping your body help itself nice and sometimes people think well i'm sore right here so the problem must be right here but sometimes the problem is somewhere else and it's linked to that yeah they, you know, you've ever heard of anything like referred pain where your problem like the pain is isn't always where the cause really directly is at so that's what we in our office focus on is getting to the root cause of your health problems. And, you know, we've probably heard us say we're neurologically based. What that really means is we're looking at where the nervous system is stressed out. It basically focusing on the nervous system, not just where your physical aches and pains are at. So we use some technology to help us pinpoint where those underlying things are really happening. So then we're addressing that root cause. And I like the technology. It's really cool. And and we're clients also at Balanced Life Chiropractic. So I can speak firsthand about that. I love the fact that you're not just guessing. Because mm-hmm. sometimes I kind of feel like it's it, it seems weird to me where they're like, they don't even know me, but they already know what the solution is. I'm like, you don't even know what the problem is yet. Right. So I love the fact that you know, you're not trying to diagnose the what's wrong with the car without opening the hood. You're actually using technology to figure out what's really going on. Yeah, I mean, we have a saying in our office to see is to know is to not see is to guess. We never want to guess with you or your family's health. So using all that technology, we have a nerve scan, muscle scan. We also take x-rays in-house. Really helps us get a bigger picture of what's going on. Really, how long have your issues been there? You know, structurally, are there things going on that's causing these? And really, what's it going to take to start making some of those changes? Because it's not something that's going to go away overnight. That's just not how health or healing really work. If somebody listening is going, hey, I would like to check this out for myself, and they would like to become a client, how do they get a hold of you at Balanced Life Chiropractic? As simple as a phone call. They can call us at 605-215-1785. Or they can shoot us a message on our Facebook page, Balanced Life Chiropractic. We'd love to chat and let you know how we can help you. Very nice. You can find them online as well. Their website is balancedlifesd.com. If your plan for the new year involves getting your financial life in order, I suggest you start with your mobile phone bill. How much do you pay every month? If that number is more than 15 bucks, it's time for a mint intervention. Mint Mobile makes it affordable and easy to switch. Get a new phone or bring your current phone at mintervention.com. You can see the current special offer from Mint Mobile, offering premium wireless for just $15 a month. That's far less than most people are paying, just $15 a month. Learn more now at Mintervention.com. That's Mintervention.com. And now Stuff Dan Finds Interesting. Yeah. It is time for Stuff Dan Finds Interesting, but today, and Heidi, he's gone. it's time for Stuff John Finds Interesting. Oh, goody. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, I actually think this is kind of cool. Have you ever wanted to be in a television ad? No. Have you ever wanted to be in like a a, a magazine ad? You know, you flip it open, you see people in there. No. Well, I'll bet somebody listening, probably uh, either they thought I could be that person or maybe they have kids that they're going, I think it would be cool to see my kids. Okay. Well, there's a lady in Sioux Falls. She sent me an email yesterday. I posted it on Facebook last night. So if you're interested in this... Dort Kuiper is her name, and I don't. I didn't ask her if I could post this. I just did because she sent it to me and a whole bunch of other people. Uh, so I'm assuming because it says open casting call. Okay. So it's not like, hey, John, we want you. Sure. I don't think anybody wants me in their ad. Open casting call for what? I, I've been the voice on many things, but I do not have the physique. Unless, of course, there's like a hot dog eating championship that they needed to film an ad for. Uh, no, it's an open casting call. It says, are you interested in being talent? For local TV commercials or print ads, join us for a brief presentation outlining the steps to be chosen as a local talent, followed by Q&A. It says, advertisers today want to showcase our diverse community, so all ethnicities and abilities are encouraged and welcome. So it's coming up Thursday, February 2nd, 
6.30 till 7.30 p.m. at the Midco Aquatic Center, meeting room one. Okay. Again, I posted this on our Facebook page last night as well. So if you're going, uh, hey, I know somebody who should do that. I've always thought that they would be, you know, great in a commercial. Uh, be sure to share that. It's at facebook.com slash sunny radio. And again, I posted it last night, so you'll see it there. Uh, scroll down a little bit if you have to. But that's kind of cool. You know, there are a lot of people who got their start in commercials. A lot of yeah, famous folks. I just want to make sure it's not one of those things like we were suckered into taking our daughter to, remember? It's been, oh, yeah, your kid can be in commercials and TV shows, and we took her to this thing, and, oh, yeah, you're chosen. You're amazing. It's only however many no, hundreds of dollars. No, this is a local person. Okay. And, nope, nope, no, this is somebody from Sioux Falls. Okay. So, uh, and, and I know, uh, I don't know her well, but I know Dort, so... Okay. Uh, if you are interested in this, once again, I posted it on our Facebook page last night, facebook.com slash sunny radio. You know how hard it is for me to say that now? Because on our syndicated show, it's always facebook.com slash John and right. Heidi show. And I've trained myself over the last five years to say that. And now when I'm trying to say the sunny page, it's <laughs> like uh, I have to force my mouth to say it. But that's where you're going to find this because... On our other show, uh, that's on all over the country, so that wouldn't make as much sense. This is right here in Sioux Falls. So Facebook.com slash Sunny Radio is where you'll find that. And I almost forgot, Heidi, it's a Wednesday. Oh, I like Wednesdays. I like Wednesdays, too. And today is our final day for the Night Ranger ticket giveaway. Grand Falls Casino and Golf Resort, they're going to be here this Saturday night. Now, if you haven't bought your tickets yet because you've been waiting, thinking, I'm going to win. Well, today's your last chance to win. So if your name is Todd Smith, S-M-I-D-T, Todd Smith, you, congratulations, are the final winner on the Night Ranger ticket giveaway. And who doesn't love Night Ranger? They're amazing. Now, we have seen that how many times? Oh, my. So many. At least probably six times. Probably more than that. So many. Uh, We even seen them in another country. So it was, and, and it was so funny because when we got to that other country and then we bumped into them, they remembered us from Sioux Falls, which is even more fun. So, uh, no, they're a great, great group. And they've been around this area numerous times. But every time they come here, they have a huge crowd. And I was told that the show was almost sold out. So if you didn't get tickets yet, you got to get your tickets today. You can do that at Grand Falls Casino Resort.com. Again, GrandFallsCasinoResort.com. And uh, again, we're all done with our ticket giveaway. So uh, if, you, if you've been waiting because you thought for sure you were going to win, I've got a couple other ticket giveaways that we're doing. If you go to SunnyRadio.com, you can click the little button on the top that says click here to win tickets and more. And uh, the Night Ranger tickets are gone now. But we have Date Night Comedy, and that's coming up. There's a Thursday and Friday show. These tickets are for Thursday, February 2nd. And then the Res Gen Men's Summit is on uh, that weekend. It's Saturday, February 4th. And we've got a few pairs of tickets to give away to date night and one pair of tickets to give away to Res Gen Men's Summit. Sign up at Facebook. No, no, not Facebook. Sign up at SunnyRadio.com. Click the Win Tickets button at the top of the page. Thanks for listening on a Wednesday. Do you ever get credit card offers in the mail? Those are usually the worst offers. They spend thousands of dollars mailing them to anyone with an address. The people who actually read their junk mail end up paying the price in the long run. At BetterCreditCards.com, we offer a variety of credit card options to fit your needs. Needs. Whether you want a credit card to give you cash back or points and perks or a credit card to help you build your credit, we probably have it at BetterCreditCards.com. Give yourself a little credit. BetterCreditCards.com. Here's your Market Beat Minute for Wednesday, January 25th, 2023. Equity markets are showing signs of caution, if not topping, in the face of a declining outlook for Q4 2022 and 2023 earnings for the S&P 500. The action Tuesday had the market up from the open, but moving sideways from Monday's action with resistance above the 4,000 level. The caution is due to a raft of economic data that is due out Wednesday through Friday. It culminates with the PCE price index Friday. The index is expected to accelerate on a sequential basis, but to decelerate versus last year, which is a mixed signal indeed. A slowdown in year-over-year inflation is good, but doesn't mean much with inflation still running at more than double the Fed's 2% target and accelerating in the near term. News that didn't get much attention Monday is the index of leading indicators, which fell by 1% and 0.3% faster than expected. This is just shy of the worst reading in the last few years, which was last month, and points to increasingly weak conditions within the U.S. economy. You can get the inside track at marketbeatminute.com.